Hi Leo, happy Monday. I hope you're having a great day. Welcome to your weekly reading. This will be for the week of December 19th through December 25th. We'll take a look at the immediate past, the current situation, and the immediate future. I do hope you're having a great day. Yes, we'll close it off with a moon card. I do hope you're looking forward to the Yule season, to the holiday, to Christmas, however you wish to celebrate it. I hope you get to spend it around some loved ones. Yes, you do have all kinds of knowledge. There's the Hierophant card. Working through the levels of the universe is a good thing. Just don't ascend too high yet. There are those who still need you down here on Earth. All right, so the overall energy for the reading is direction. You're at a crossroads. You're looking for help, for direction in your life. Well, you came to the right place. Let's see if we can get you some. In the future, it's all about healing. The stars coming down to see you. What a wonderful thing, truly. But you hold on, okay? There's a whole lot of love coming at you. I assure you. All right, in the immediate past, you have the King of Swords, the Knave of Chalices, and the Tower Moment. You were so sure of yourself, and you knew that the offer was coming in from the Spirit, and you weren't quite sure what it was telling you, and when you found out, it truly was a Tower Moment in your life. And the universe wants you to know that it's okay. Sometimes we just can't see what's in front of us. When something bad happens, to know the ins and outs of another can be hard. Sometimes it takes the universe holding you together to show you what you missed, to see how you could have helped someone had you just stuck around. You know, I know the truth was very hard to bear. I get it. If I had witnessed it, I probably would have felt the same way. But you were true in your actions and right. You truly were. In the current situation, you're acting with true integrity. You are. And you're finally starting to understand and see what a role you truly played in that other person's life. And in the future, Spirit's just asking you to get up one more time. Just to get up again and start again with the emperor mode because you truly know the right things to do. You know the right decisions and the right choices to make. You know how to walk with integrity and you finally found the right people to help you on your life's quest, your life's mission, so to speak, to truly allow that healing to come. Let's go ahead and take a look and get some clarity on the current situation where you realize, yeah, we don't really need it, do we? But we'll go ahead and take a look at the healing going on. Yeah, we don't really need it. I, I can tell. All right, we'll go ahead and we'll put these cards down. You sure? Okay. All right. Cut. Yes, I know. I truly respect you as well. Truly, I do. The Devil card. The Ace of Pentacles. And the Ten of Wands. Yep, I know. It's crazy, right? To think. It's felt you had to get your shit and leave. We know. It was a big undertaking. But we're wondering now, are you ready? Are you ready to help heal a heart? What do you say? Help heal a heart. Help them get back what they lost and quit juggling. 
so that the one you truly care about, the one you love, truly will get to be like the whole Nine of Pentacles without too much heartache and despair. Well, I know you do, and I know you want the very best for your, for this person. I know you do. They want the very best for you as well. I can tell, I can just feel the energy. They want the very best for you. Sure, I'll get a sacred destiny card. Yes, I know. I'm trying my best to put it all together. It's not always easy. I hear so many messages these days. So many things have changed. Spirits of nature are very real. I wish I had understood so long ago the effects of a plant or a fairy to truly understand the magical ways of nature. They eluded me. I didn't understand. Nobody taught me. So I taught myself for the past 20 odd years. Luckily, there's people like you in the world that can help a person learn and grow. Relaxation, yeah. Just relax and chill. The journey's almost over. Power, yeah. Very powerful. Perhaps one day I too will know that power and be able to be diligent and fair in all my dealings and truly listen with an open mind and heart to others. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where the messages come from. I just let them come out. I'm well aware, you know. The universe just wants to say thank you. A very big thank you for who you are and what you're doing. It is a true delight to watch those grow when they come to see the light and they allow that little one to thrive. It truly is a wonder, is it not? When you look at them and you're like, how did I not see it? How did they not understand what was inside of them? to understand the ebb and flow of life, to really work with the cycles of the moon, which is true wisdom, true wisdom, that sat at the right hand of God in the heavens and earth with me. And when you look at that, that flow of life, that love, that power, when you work with Mother Earth, true transformation can happen Hmm, funny, my cup. True transformation requires change. I actually have in jasmine tea. It's the time of year for it. True transformation, like the butterfly, which will bring all kinds of love into our life. Absolutely. So let's go ahead and get you a moon card. I care deeply for you too. Truly I do. I pray one day we see each other again. Maybe in the heavens above. Have faith in your dreams. They're all going to come to fruition. Just keep asking yourself, what do you need to release? You know what they say, don't go to bed angry, right? Don't let the sun go down with hatred in your heart. Think about it. Just let it all just float away and know that your hard work truly is paying off. All right, love and light to you always. I wish you the very best in life. I truly do. Bright blessings and namaste. Bye-bye.